What if the deadly cesium-137 radiotherapy machine in Goiania, Brazil, was never found by authorities in 1987? Two scavengers broke into an abandoned medical clinic and discovered a strange metal capsule. Inside was a beautiful blue glowing powder that sparkled like fairy dust. They took it home, fascinated by its ethereal glow in the dark. Soon, families across the city were playing with the mysterious substance. Parents rubbed it on their children's skin like magical face paint. Kids mixed it into their food, watching their meals glow bright blue. Within days, people started getting sick with what seemed like the flu. Nausea, vomiting, hair falling out in clumps, but doctors had no idea they were treating severe radiation poisoning. Entire neighborhoods would have become uninhabitable dead zones. Thousands could have died from cancer over the following decades. This near catastrophe would have become South America's first major nuclear disaster. The terrifying truth is similar abandoned radiation sources still exist worldwide, waiting to be found.